Welcome to tkcast.hostsl.com. Today we'll be uh, doing a basic Cisco uh, Mobile Connect setup. Um, pretty much it's like uh, say like uh, say like you have a cell phone, you know, and and an office phone, you know, and uh, when someone call you, you can use either phone to like answer the call. And say you answer your cell phone uh, outside the office, and you you go ahead, you know, and you want to transfer it to uh, to uh, to your office phone. You can do that with this feature. Uh, same thing is like when you're in the office, you know, and you need to go somewhere, you know, you can switch it to your cell phone and uh, take the call from it, you know, and switch back and forth. So uh, that's pretty much it about um, Cisco Mobile Connect. But today we're gonna go ahead and configure Cisco Mobile Connect feature on uh, HQ Phone 2, which is um, this phone, 5002 extension. Um, we're gonna make sure any income, incoming call to um, HQ Phone 2 should ring stimulously on uh, headquarter phone 2 this guy and uh, PSTN this one right here uh, the only problem is that uh, with cell phone there's a, a little bug in it it won't re ring this when this guy someone called this guy these two guys supposed to ring but only this guy ring but it seems like it pop up so it's try to work but there's a bug in the cell phone uh, I already tried with the hard phone. It does that, so I know it's work. So, but you know, uh, I I don't have access to hard phone. You know, doing uh, remotely right now. So uh, anyway, um, uh, like I said, we're gonna use that phone. Also, right here, we will pretend this guy is a cell phone. Okay, the PSTN number right here, headquarter. We're gonna pretend that has a cell phone, and uh, we wanna make sure the mobility self key should be displayed on uh, uh, headquarter phone two. Okay, so let's get it started with it. So the first thing we need to do is go ahead and create a user by going to user management and user. Uh, go ahead and click on new, and we're gonna give it the name. I'm gonna call it, um, it um, um, Mobility Connect Password 1234 1234 Same thing with the pin and 1234 Last name I'm gonna call it Connect. First name, I'm going to call Mobility. Phone number that I'm going to associate with is 502. Um, go ahead and save it from here. Uh, click on Device Associate. Click on Find. And find that 502. It's this guy right here. Click on Save then go back and scroll down where you see primary station where you click it and since select uh, mobility enable mobility and enable mobility void access okay and go ahead and save it and after that you need to go to device phone and go ahead and go to that um, headquarter phone 2 and right here scroll down where you see um, owner user ID this is very important make sure you select that user that you create for the uh, mobility connect okay and go ahead and save it and Go ahead and uh, click on relate relate 
links and go down where you see uh, copy to remote destination profile click on that go and right here you gotta give it a name I'm gonna whatever you like you know doesn't matter or DPP uh, mobile that's fine user ID is mobility connect CSS and reroute make sure you have reroute the same CSS has the, the phone I use I use that and uncheck this if you don't use, have anything just go ahead and check it anyway go ahead and save it and next we're gonna go ahead and uh, add a new remote destination uh, give it a name um, card or di mobile is fine and the, the designate number is gonna be this number right here since oops since uh, headquarters is local you know I can just dial the seven digit number three nine four two one two three I have a route pattern that I made you know for local but uh, like I uh, mentioned from the other video some company you know when when you um, they require you to dial a nine to access the line so um, so I have a nine you know in my route pattern you know so that you have to press a nine in order to access the phone to dial out to whatever you want so right here you need to do a, a nine and with that number um, three nine four two one two three okay and you can make this zero make sure you check this also okay mobile phone and enable mobile connect make sure you check that go ahead and save it and check this line associate save it and then go back to uh, the the remote uh, destination profile configuration click on file 2 line 5002 and okay just go ahead and scroll down on the bottom where we'll say multiple call or call waiting setting on device or DP mobile so you got the maximum call just make it one that's fine okay um, okay so now we need to go ahead and make a, the soft key for the, the phone so I'm going to go to device device setting and sub key template and go ahead and click on standard user and make copy that rename it I just call it uh, mobility save it and then click on uh, go with a configure sub key out layout and for my on hook I want mobility I'm just move it up so that and then save it and then I want when it connect I want to have it also so move it up so I don't have to look for it so it's show in front of you when you move it up to the front okay so now go to your phone look for headquarter phone 2 and then go to your sub key template make sure you select the one you just make the sub key save it okay now let's go ahead and reset and restart it okay and we can go ahead and test it we're gonna call it to 502 
happen here? Oh, five zero zero two. See right here. I mean, it's supposed to ring this also, but there's a bug here that's not showing. So I'm gonna answer it, and we have mobility right here. You see, we have mobility. We're gonna click on that, and we're gonna send it to this phone right here. So there you go. It's ring. Answer it. Okay. So now it's it's like you're on the cell phone right now. So you can talk. You can go wherever you know outside the office and stuff like that. So um, when you're done with it, you can go ahead and uh, end the call. It'll go back to over here. See? Now resume. And that's pretty much it. Now we know that it's working. So we're gonna go ahead and end the call. So um, that's pretty much how you set up um, basic mobility connect. Um, uh, so uh, pretty much it. Um, thank you for watching this video. I hope you uh, follow up for more video. Thank you.